Okay, and what about the installation? The installation should be taken care by the reason the next point is that um, this kind of material, it's organic material, will rot. Rot means it's a process of life again. By the reason, rotting means that little fungi is eating the wood. The wood, in principle, is together by two uh, parts. This is the lignin and the cellulose. And different kinds of fungi eat these or those. If <coughs> both is not good for the stability of the equipment, rotten equipment should be repaired and should be so good maintained that the rotting is not quick coming up. So, in rotting, we should look first for the kind of wood. There are some wood is very quick rotting outside, other wood is not so quick rotting. We should use and decide to make equipment from a kind of wood was not quick rotting. For example, we ourselves, we used larix, larix, very good quality, growing in the mountain, has small earrings, as smaller the earrings, as higher the quality is. If you look to the same botanically named like the Sidua in the valleys, they have big earrings, and the big earrings are much weaker and much quicker rotting. So, if we had to make the decision for the kind of wood, then there is different ways to protect them against rotting. Rotting just will come by two criteria, three criteria. You need the material here, the botanic material, botanic material, then you need wetness and you need oxygen. With oxygen and wetness, it will rot. By the reason, the fungi does need for eating wetness and oxygen. If one of the criteria is not, then it will not rot. For example, we, we know castles, churches, old buildings, the wooden structure under the roof are some hundred years old, not rotten. So if there is dry, the wood will be not rot, or very slow rot. If, on the other hand, oxygen is not there, and just wetness as well not rotting, we do know uh, the ship uh, Plymouth, what is it, Marianne? No. Uh, Mary, Mary Rose. Rose. Mary Rose. The Mary Rose was a famous warship in the England, south of England. They make a new, wonderful, great ship. And then this ship was, in the first day coming down, was <clears throat> sunk, immediately sunken in the moment the, the king comes to look to it. <laughs> the interesting thing is, this ship sank down in the sea and goes deep in the mud. This area was full of mud and it goes in the mud and the mud did away the oxygen. So this ship later, some hundred years later, it was coming, uh, survived, or uh, bring it out of the water and in a museum and they find out the wood was absolute good condition. We have some the same effect in the Sweden, in the Vasa, the Vasa as well was uh, new done and sunk immediately and so they bring it later out of the mud without the oxygen and then by this reason the rotting of this wood was not oh, deep in the water but not rotting by the reason not oxygen enough for the little fungi to eat it. So we need type 2 criterion for rotting, this is the water or the oxygen. The oxygen we cannot do away, but the wetness we can a little bit handle. We can make it in the construction so that no water places a hold in the wooden structure. Uh, so if we are able, or to make a roof over. Uh, so usually uh, if we are able to bring away the wetness or that we protect against wetness, then we have d done a good step uh, that it will very, very no slow rotting. One point more is, as well touching this, is the installation. If you install wood and you bring this wood in the ground directly, then the point, it comes in the wood, 
it comes out of the wood, out of, of the earth. This is the dangerous point by the reason. The level of the earth coming out, the moment coming out, this is the dangerous point. Maybe you can see it here. Here. Here, there is oxygen and wetness. And if you have the wood, in this case, this is the most dangerous place for rotting. So, where we try to work with steel feet. We give the wood out of the ground a little bit and give a very strong, a good steel post in the wood so that all powers comes out of the play to the foundations will be taken by the metal shoe of the wooden post. So this is a principle. It should be a good idea that as often as possible uh, to work with steel foundation feet. I do not know the right word for this, but okay. I think you understand what is meant by this. Then the next point is the maintaining. Maintaining means looking to, taking care, looking for safety questions, looking as well for long life questions. The maintain, maintenance uh, department is the most important department after making the, uh, the, the resolution for play value. Play value is the most important thing. The, the children should come and play. This is the most point. Then, to hold the play criterion, the play quality, and the safety quality, to hold it, then there is a need that there is a good department that, and a good structure that this will exist longer, will long life. The play value should long life, the safety should long life. This is just possible if you have a good technical department taking care and making a good maintenance. A good maintenance taking care about uh, st st uh, st stability. stability, as well um, <clears throat> uh, taking care about the safety, as well taking care about clean and operation and ecological points. So maintenance department is for me one of the highest respected departments by the reason they have the duty to help that the children will be able to play long time in a safe, safe way. Thanks.